Hey everyone again, Tim with Tim's Computer Repair once again here. Got a little X360 HP laptop here. This particular model is a Spectre X360. It's a 13-A series. And what is going on with this is very interesting. So let's open it up. And we'll notice here, this is how it was brought to me. See that? That power button is flashing. See there? Come on again. It'll go back off. All right. And it'll just keep doing that. So when you press the power button, it just keeps doing it. So, and it doesn't power on. So we're going to uh, we're going to investigate this a little bit further. Don't know if anybody's ever come across an issue like that, but we are going to. I am going to hope that it is just simply a battery issue. So let's see what happens when I plug in the power adapter here. Power. Power is on this side, so let's plug that in. And this power adapter has been tested as being good. And we still have a flashing power button. Open this up. Power it on. nothing just flashing regardless of what we do there and I've even sat here and tried to hold this down for 15 or more seconds that does absolutely nothing either so we are stuck with having to open it up and investigate take a couple of screws out down here on this end And then we have, looks like somebody's been goofing around in here. Should have a couple of screws underneath this tape here. See if I can get to that. Okay, here's a screw here. Another one here. Another one here. Yeah, that one was. Alright, and let's just put that back just nice and gently there for a moment. Get to this side to see if there's anything under here. Oh, there's one there for sure. Okay. All 
All right, let's open this up. And let's see about what we're going to see inside here. Okay. And there we have the inside. Hell, most, most of the inside is a dang battery. How about that? Everything looks okay in here, really. No real signs of like any sort of a liquid damage or anything, but I'm going to go straight for the battery here. Let's hopefully uh, see how... See if this, this will definitely stop the light from flashing, but let's see. We're just... Uh, pop this battery out. Boop. All right. And obviously, obviously the light now is not blinking anymore. Now let's just pop this back in. <laughs> mm -hmm. All right, that pops back in. Now we look. And now the power light is not flashing any longer so we've cleared that let's see if it'll boot now I'm just going to rest that on there temporarily open it up And we'll press the power button here. Nothing yet. Let's try it again. Power button. Nothing at all. Let's try plugging in the charger. Charger's plugged in. Try powering it on. Oh, we got a light. And the light is steady. But that is about it. Getting no, no screen, no post, no lights. Caps lock light on the keyboard. Oh, that just came on. Okay. Hey, look at there. We got a post. And let's see if we can get this to boot all the way here. It 
sometimes it's like that with these batteries. Sometimes that's all you have to do is is uh, disconnect them and reconnect them. We got uh, HP logo here. Yep, it's loading. Sometimes it, that just happens with batteries with the laptops. It's real funny. Macs and, and PCs. Uh, it's real funny that way. How that works. So this is going to be working just fine now. Listen. It just goes to show, you ever have a computer or a laptop, specifically a laptop, when you press that power button and nothing happens, or you have just something flashing, either on the keyboard or, for instance, this power button flashing, the very first thing that you should uh, uh, troubleshoot and uh, go after is unplugging the battery and plugging it back in or you can unplug the battery and while it's unplugged plug the computer in and press the power button faulty batteries can even keep your computer or your laptop from from booting up even if it's plugged in so anyway this looks like this is going to be just fine. Quick little video. Just to show you how batteries can sometimes be the issue with your laptop. Funny issues at times. Anyways, I'm Tim with Tim's Computer Repair. Have a great YouTube day. Hey, if you enjoyed this video, why don't you head right down below here, hit that like button, subscribe to my channel. That would be really awesome. I have much more computer repair videos coming your way. There's also a bell you can click for to get notifications for my videos. I really appreciate everybody's support. And as usual, everyone, until next time, see you soon.